It used to be I was pretty good at football games, but nowadays when I fire up the old machine, I feel like I've been kidnapped out of my house, fitted for pads and a helmet, and thrown out onto the huddle itself. Needless to say, I was never prepared for it, and I get sacked, picked off, and made fun of constantly by my friends. Jeez, I thought video games were supposed to be fun. Call me old and grumpy, but there's really something to be said for the simplicity of old video games and how they have been developed into a learning intensive ordeal nowadays. EA Sports and High Score Productions team up again to bring you a gridiron action at its greatest with Madden NFL 94. Hi everyone, welcome to John Madden Football. I'd have to say my favorite football game is a tie between this and Tecmo Super Bowl. Madden 94 gets more points for firsts in football games. Just the beginning of the game demonstrates this fact with the EA Sports It's in the Game audio tag being introduced for the first time into the Madden series. Madden 94 was the first football game with an NFL team license, although no NFLPA license, so no names yet, just numbers. It is also the first game where you could play through an entire 16-week season, complete with standings and playoff runs. The game also does a good job of making John Madden look like he's talking to you about how scoring more points will help your team win, or going off on another Brett Favre rant. In the Team Select screen, you can choose classic Super Bowl teams, including the 1989 San Francisco 49ers, the 75 Steelers, and the 85 Bears. There are also 12 all-time, all-star franchise, and two all-Madden teams. You can also choose the conditions of the game, whether you want clear skies, heavy rain, or an ice bowl remake. Thing is, with snow, the field just turns silver. The game begins with a coin toss, and then the players take the field. The play selection in today's football games can be traced to this game where you can select a package and a passing or running play. If you decide you picked the wrong play, call an audible, of which you can select up to three offensive and defensive audibles. If you've played this game before, you know how important it is to have a great running back. Play with the Steelers' Barry Foster, or better yet, the Lions' Barry Sanders or the Cowboys' Emmett Smith, and you'll know what I'm talking about. They are incredibly freaking fast. If they so much as touch the football, they will get 10 yards a carry. The spin and hurdle mechanisms for rushing are not extremely useful unless you're rushing for six and want to make fun of your little brother. The passing system can be very confusing if you don't read the play art before you execute the play on the field. The ABC receivers don't go from right to left, or any particular direction for that matter, so you're left to guess from the passing windows who is open and who is covered by the entire backfield. If you're battling a CB to catch an incoming pass, you can do little but stand around and hold the C button and hope the ball falls into your outstretched arms. Although it has its imperfections, Madden 94 still makes for a solid, fast-paced game. It shines in its simplicity and the fun factor and replay value are high. Moreover, the controls aren't overdone. Just Three buttons and a D-pad are all you need to achieve gridiron greatness in Madden NFL 94.